What's good, YouTube? It's your boy, Reggie Rich, and welcome back to another video. To give you guys a little bit of context before I let this video play, um, this new customer that I got to my business, um, I have I know him. I used to work with him, well, not work with him directly. Back when I was working my nine to five, when I was in the property management business, I was, I was the clubhouse manager at the time. And he used to be the, the chef that the people that celebrating in the clubhouse that they hired to pretty much, you know, do the catering, the cooking and all that. And at the time, me and him, we, we, we connected, I suppose, but we never really exchanged numbers, but somehow he got my numbers. Yeah, I don't know how that happened, but it happened. Um, I'm assuming somebody that he knows, that I know, maybe a mutual friend, um, they probably gave him my number and they told him what I'm doing now as far as my business. And that was the reason why I'm thinking he reached out to me a few days ago. But anyway, a few days ago, he gave me a call just to pretty much talk business. Um, and he's he pretty much told me that this is what he does, which I know what he does. And he wants to know if I'm able to pretty much stay on call just in case if he were to need me to help um, so I can help him take his, you know, uh, his food and everything, plates, everything like that from the restaurant to wherever he has um, a party for that day. I said, okay, just, you know, just shoot me a call. Let me know. So today, and he also told me that this might not be the only thing he calls me for. He also has miscellaneous jobs that he might need me for, which today was the first one that I did. But I got to say overall, the experience today with that job that I did for him today, which was one of those miscellaneous jobs that he was talking about, it wasn't bad. Um, it was hot as hell, bro. I, today, I, I feel like I worked. I worked for that money. Um, I'm talking about like, what is it right? Yeah, it was it was over 95 degrees. It felt like it was over 100 degrees outside today, bro. But the experience was good, and um, I'm gonna go ahead and let the video play. <sighs> so today's gonna be a little bit different, guys. Um, the reason why I say that is because I believe I may have just gotten myself a new customer, and um, this customer may possibly be bringing me different jobs every single day or well, every other day okay so yeah like i was saying guys i think i may i may have a potential customer that's gonna give me a lot of jobs moving forward so we'll see let's go ahead and um and get this job done and see what's and see what we're working with Chef! So I'm gonna, I'm gonna walk you guys and show you guys everything that I'm doing in this drop off, well, in this pickup every step of the way. And uh, y'all let me know, man. Let me know, man. So you said those? Yeah, yeah only those. Six of them, right? Okay. And what else? Show me what else. No, no, you, sh you showed me something else over there. Okay, because I'm trying to, you know. All right. I'm not sure you tell me, chef. You said that bag right there, right? Uh, okay. 
So after that bag, what else? That's it? Uh, let me go load that up then. So let me go ahead and strap these up right there so it doesn't you know fall on top of the glass while i'm driving it's better to be safe than sorry so let me do that and um, i'll catch you guys in a few minutes so quick little update for you guys so um by the time well maybe about 15 minutes before i got to my drop off location from the um the chef's uh pickup i called the person that was supposed to be here to receive the delivery but they weren't there and my only issue with that is um, I had two pre-scheduled uh, delivery with dispatch and because they weren't there my dispatch delivery was around the same time so I had to kind of maneuver to see how I was able to pretty much get those things out of my cargo van so I can make space for my um, dispatch pickup so what I did was because the drop-off of um, the chef's delivery is right next to my house I dropped them off at my crib um, since it's, it's about like maybe a minute away my the drop-off is about a minute away from my house So I dropped them off at my house and I'm currently doing the dispatch uh, Delivery right now, which I kind of have it loaded up already and I'm at the drop-off location, too So it's that TV right there. I don't know if you guys could see it But it's that 75 inch right there, but um, yeah, so now I'm trying to get this out the way go do my next um, pickup with dispatch and then go finish the delivery that I had with the chef. So as soon as I'm done with that, um, the next clip is, you, brought, you guys are probably gonna see me um, unloading um, the stuff for the chef. So I'll see you guys real soon. Let me pull up a little bit. Yeah, he told me you're gonna have some things for me. Back, yeah. In the back? Okay, cool.
Can I meet you in the back? Yeah. Okay. Hold on. All right. So I sit on the table. How about the the place in there? Yeah, because the 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 back is too low. Go to back over. We can go there. Wash up it. Yeah, we can go there. Right, guys so uh, we dropped off the load that we um, we had in the back of the cargo van as y'all can see from the last clip but we also had to pick up um, a load from the drop-off location to bring back to the chef's location now the only issue um, which I'm gonna go ahead and uh, call it a day after this is that the chef told me because um, at the time that I'm, I was supposed to head back to the shop he's not gonna be there so he pretty much told me to hold on to it overnight and um, tomorrow morning I can go ahead and bring it back to the shop. The reason why I'm okay with that is because he actually booked me for another job tomorrow and um, it's a moving job. Um, it's some things that he has in his storage and he wants to take them from the storage and bring them back to the shop. So um, that right there, I'm going to make a separate video for that and you guys need to stay tuned because the price that I'm charging for that, it's... Um, I need some I need, I need y'all take on that so so that's pretty much it for the day man so um oh by the way um I charge um f the things that I picked up from his shop to the drop off I charged seventy dollars um it wasn't it wasn't too much of a drive it was 30 minutes away um from the drop off to the pickup well from the pickup to the drop off was 30 minutes away and um uh, of course the what I'm picking up to go back to the um back to his location it's another 30 minutes so Seventy dollars was was what I charged for the load, and now that I have to go back to his uh his shop to return what I picked up, that's another seventy dollars. So that's about one hundred and forty, and um, I'll take that. And I also had some dispatch that I was doing in the meanwhile. So today today turned out to be a good day. It wasn't bad. It wasn't bad. So this your boy Reggie Rich. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Um, don't forget to like the video, subscribe to the channel. If you do want to leave a comment down below, you know what to do. Go ahead and leave a comment down below, man. We ran it up again today, um, and uh, we are out.